Yeah, I mean, I've worked for Peter for a long time, and I've always been helping him create his vision. And this was sort of just a sort of a reversal where P Peter and Fran and Philippa were helping me create my film. Um, and you know, Peter's advice has always been to sort of trust your instincts, you know, trust your gut, um, but also you know, never settle for anything that the, the film doesn't deserve. Put the film first. Always tell the story. Try and design a shot that's the most you know, interesting and efficient way to tell the story. Mm. I mean, real nuts and bolts stuff, you know, sort of, yeah. you know, there's no sort of, you know, high, you know, high theory or film school kind of theory. It's actually just real sort of practical mindsets in which to get into to, to approach the work. Mm -hmm. And then the rest of it is just like, and then go for it. Just, just, you know, you know, it's up to you now. Well, I mean, look, it, it that, that, that's the catch-22, right? Is, is that, you know, it's the hardest thing to get a studio on board with the idea that this isn't something that, that anyone's seen before. But it's also what they want. They want they want a new, you know, they, they, they want a new set of stories that have a longevity. And Philip has, you know, many other books that he's written in this world. Um, and it is risky. It is risky. But, you know, I, I think audiences, you know, they want something new. Um, and hopefully that's what we've, we've, we, we can give to them. Look, yeah, I mean, yeah, I'd, I'd love to. I mean, I've fallen in love with this world. I've fallen in love with these characters. Um, I love working with the cast. They're all amazing, amazing bunch of people, and a lot of them, most of them, come back. Um, uh, but you know, I think, I think, you know, I'd, that'd be a discussion to have with Pete. You know, he, he might, he might secretly want to direct the next yeah. one.